Hi everyone, this is FA Games and today we are going to set up PS3 emulator for PC. So let's get started. Now first of all you need to download the emulator from their official website. So I have already downloaded the emulator. So you can download the emulator uh, as I have already done it. So I want to repeat these steps. Second thing which is required is PlayStation 3 update. So you need to download the lastest version of PlayStation 3 update. So you can download that from their official website. Here's the official website. So download it. Now we are going to install the firmware. So all you have to do is select the PS3 update folder where you have saved the update so it's going to take like five or six seconds to install and then it's going to install some modules so you need to wait for that So as you can see it's taking some time, wait for it. So now it is completed and we are going to go to our configurations. For configurations I will leave everything as it is as you can explore different settings but I will recommend you to keep as it is as there's nothing much to change for GPU there are two options uh, one is open GUL and second is Redcon. so I will recommend you to adjust accordingly but I'm going to test both of them so you can see the difference between both of settings rest of them I'm going to keep as it is for the gamepad you can set up your PlayStation and it's going to work you can keep the setting uh, select PlayStation or keyboard it's up to you now we are going to install our game since we uh, since I have PKG file so I'm gonna install my PKG file now this PKG file may take like uh, 10 or 15 minutes so I'm going to quickly speed up the process and we are going to see after the installation of the game PKG file has been successfully installed.
now let the game load this is going to take a couple of minutes till the game load and after that we are going to try different render so you can see the different difference yourself start loading and now we are going to play the game We are going to go change our render to Vulcan and see the difference in performance, how different it is from OpenGL. So you can decide yourself from the performance. See the difference now. I think the webcam would work much better for me as I have GTX 1060. So I think that it is working much better 
for me at least but for different system it worked differently so you have to check which one is working perfectly for you